Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to duplicate components on Webflow. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. So as you can see, guys, we are right now on Webflow website. So this is how the interface looks like. So here in the top, we're going to find products, solutions, resources, enterprise, pricing, and you can contact sales and lastly, view dashboard. So what you need to do guys right now is click on view dashboard. Once you click on view dashboard, just wait for the dashboard to load. And as you can see guys right here, you're going to find a list including all of the sites that you created before. From here, you can switch to tutorials and you can sort by date, alphabetical, less modified, you can create a new folder or you can also create a new site if you don't have a site. So for me, I'm just gonna edit my site that I already created. So in order to do that, just hover your mouse over the site and then click on Open Designer. Once you click on Open Designer, just wait for it to load. And then as you can see, guys, now it's loaded. So basically, guys, from here, you can find all of the tools that you will need in order to customize your site. And right here, you're going to find all everything you have on your site, your texts, buttons, images, every item that you have on your site. So basically, guys, in order to create a new component, just click on anything here and then go to the right side and click on create component. Once you do that, just choose a name for it and then click on create and then click on back to instance. So basically guys, once you create your component, just go here and click on this little pencil in order to edit your components. So basically guys, here in the settings, you can edit everything related to your component. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.